Hi, my name is Gabriel, um, aka King Aries. Today I'm on my new YouTube channel. Um, I'm here to talk to you, talk to y'all today about a certain situation that is is uh, currently going on with a person called Hartley Sawyer. Uh, and uh, all the racist, misogynistic uh, tweets that are going around right now, or resurfacing, I should say. And yes, I have read all of them. Really suck. Some some of them that are are uh, that are there. Some of them are very horrible. And some of them, some of them are they do cross a huge line, a very huge line. And while I understand why there are some people that are angry about it, there's some people that are um, that are hurt by it and yes I, I I'm not gonna lie I was a little hurt by it when I first read read all of them thinking that this could come from someone that I actually enjoy watching someone that I actually enjoy um, listening to or someone that portraying a character that act at first I really did not care for so it's for me personally someone brought it up to my attention that if that if the Flash does another second chance storyline or, you know, that your past doesn't define who you are as a person today, they're gonna think bullshit. They're gonna it's not gonna not gonna they're not gonna take it as seriously because of you know, they can put it into a show but they're not gonna they're not gonna apply it in real life. And I actually I ne I didn't really think about it like that until he brought it up to me. Um like I said, I have I've read them all, and I do understand the situation, and I there there are part of me that feels like the situation is blown up because of the whole Black Lives Matter thing that's going on right now, and the protest that is currently going on. You know, it's it is what it is, and you know everyone has to account for their consequences. Everyone has to own up to them, and everyone has to. Um, you know, take accountability for them. You know, everyone, there's, they always say karma comes back t to those who deserve it. I'm a big believer in karma. But, I do, f I do agree with my friend when I think that, that, that he should be held accountable for those tweets. But I don't think that he should have gotten fired for them because of the fact that they were eight, almost, eight years ago, almost basically a decade. Now, if this was a, a situation where, you know, he was still saying them to this day and like there were some tweets that he was hiding that, that were going right now, this would be a whole different kind of situation entirely. But, you know, I, me and my pain, I, I really don't think that he should have gotten fired for it. And I'm just I'm just saying all this to say that, you know, Hartley, Hartley Sawyer, if you do watch this, I, it hurts me that you did say these things, and it really does, it does bother me in certain parts of my body, but, you know, I, I do feel like, I've read your apology, and I do feel like if you really sincerely do, you know, feel that you are ashamed about these, then I, I fully support, I fully support you, man, I hope that, Everything goes well with you and your career in acting. If if anybody will still hire you and everything, and hopefully every this isn't the end of your career because I don't I don't want I don't want this to be the end for you, man. And the whole Flash cast, I d I do understand where they're coming from, you know. But you know this is this is only like I said this is no particular order. This is just basically just Harley story. I really hope, man, you bounce back for this. Like I said, uh, I'm taking the, I'm, I'm putting into practice like the lessons I've been watching with Arrow, uh, with Flash, Legend of Tomorrow, uh, Black Lightning, every, all of them, but Flash especially. Like I feel like you do deserve a second chance when it when it comes to this. I do still think you, I, that you should be held accountable for them. You know, you know what I'm saying? And hopefully, like I said, this isn't the last for you. I'm a, I'm a, I'm an optimistic person, very, 
So maybe that's just the optimistic side of me talking, talking about Harley like this way. But um, like I said, it still does bother me. It really does. But hopefully, this this doesn't you know this doesn't be your your legacy that ends. This doesn't be the thing that ends your legacy with acting and career. Hopefully that you still get to bounce back from this. But um, like I said, I don't want to hold hold up you guys' time any much longer. I, like I said, I just wanted to give my input. I'm trying to, I'm trying to, uh, you know, get my voice out there. You know, get open my open my shell, open my uh, barriers up a little bit more, and hopefully, this, hopefully he sees this. Hopefully he knows that there aren't, there are people, there are some people out here that don't completely hate you. You know, and don't fully think that you're this type of person that, you know, everyone says you are now, um, but, yeah, um, if you guys are watching this, thank you for, you know, actually watching, listening to me, um, then, yeah, Harley Sawyer, sorry, man, but, yeah, hopefully, like I said, hopefully you bounce back from this, peace.